palpable fear as Poland military officers arrived in Nigeria to force Tunubu out of Asorok. Others silence of all protesters. All right, Nigerians now. So Poland, 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 an international country um, have sent their delegates, not just delegates, but their military officers um, down to Nigeria for a mission, which I tell you, even you yourself, you know, go believe why they actually came. I, I was thinking that it was a joke, not until when I saw it happen. No be joke, my people, no be play play, because um, not just Poland, but some other international communities have um, set in for this very protest. Uh, they say na international, uh, uh, they say na foreign sponsors and all of that, mm, my people. Okay, let's quickly, as a matter of all, let's um, quickly check on this very content and then let's know what truly the truth actually is. This is today's news. The Polish Ministry of Foreign Affairs is actively working to secure the release of seven Polish nationals who were detained in Kano. Nigerian among those detained are six students and a lecturer from the University of Wasa. Their arrest occurred and widespread protest in the region, sparking concern both in Poland and internationally. Reports from Nigerian authorities suggest that the group was detained for allegedly displaying foreign flags during the protest. A spokesperson for the Nigerian security service claimed that this was the reason for their arrest. However, the Polish government has strongly refuted this allegation. Polish Deputy Foreign Minister Adrezak Zinjana addressed the situation, stating, stating that the detained individuals were not carrying any flags. Instead, they were reportedly photographing the ongoing protest. Polish consular services are actively seeking their release and are in contact with both the Nigerian authorities and the student families, since Jana told the Polish press agency PAP. In response to the incident, the Polish government has dismissed media reports suggesting that the reports was displaying Russian flags during their intention. These clarifications aims to counter any misinformation and ensure that the focus remains on securing the safe return of their citizens. Thank you for listening to today's news. You see how quick, how quick they responded. You see? Hmm. Oh, you born the waste time. <laughs> and if uh, I may even say anything concerning what they have just said, I'll tell you that what they just said is the reality. You know, say Oyibo oh, like to the you know camera, and they take part in any thing of this of this such. Nobody say they go join you agitator. They don't agitate, but they will just film everywhere so that they will see what thing they will take back, take back to their country. So um, I think um, the Polish um, nationals and delegates sent to Nigeria for the to, to, to set their their members, their their arrested members free can be telling you the truth. Do you understand? Can be telling you the truth because. Looking at it from evidence to prove these guys are students. So as a student, they cannot just, you know, decide to join, uh, come to Nigeria and join the agitation for this, uh, for this reason. You understand? And that is one thing I would really like us to really consider when we are actually giving this a, a look. You understand, and that's just it.
So, uh, dear listeners, I joined the Polish country for this very purpose, and uh, I joined them for this very reason, and uh, and also I joined them for this very call to urge the federal government of Nigeria to reconsider and allow these uh, individuals, okay, these individuals to um, to find their way back, you know, to their country because uh, it can be very very true that they know nothing about this very situation. You understand? Yes, it can be very very true. So, um, based on what already I've told we said, my fellow fellow listeners out there. I would really like you to uh, respond to this and um, also to give us a quick look so that um, we will not be making a big mistake at the later end. Please don't forget to leave your comments below the comments section. Click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell button.